Um, and I guess this is its own segment, but we have to talk about the controversy of Assassin's Creed Shadows, in which you can play as a female ninja, and uh, uh, Yasuke, the, uh, one of the last samurai, mm -hmm. a black samurai, mm -hmm. who was in Japan. Um, there was some controversy, and by controversy, I mean racist. Yes, who and are sexist. Oh, Don't forget that. Honestly, the sexism was a little more toned down. Yeah. I saw more about the, him. The racists are usually louder in general. Yeah, so, and they're mad because it goes, I want to play a game in Japan where I play as a Japanese samurai, as if there's not 30,000 samurai games where you can do that. Have you heard of this little-known indie game? It was very well-received, but it, but it was it was... Very small. Uh, Ghost of Tsushima. <laughs> and the uh, Dynasty Warriors, all 30 games of those. Yes. Uh, Way of the Samurai, that was a whole entire franchise. Uh, uh, like a Dragon Ishin. Uh, you know, you know, just, you know, mm -hmm. just you know, we got, uh, you know, you could just play those. And, and then there was a huge debate of whether or not he was an official samurai, which he was a retainer for a lord and got the lord's swords when he died. Every Japanese historian on the planet says he is one. Now, my, what my, are you smoking? My, my other question is, um, who cares? You yeah. get to be a samurai, and that's cool. <laughs> I say this as someone who has only played two Assassin's Creed games in my life. You get to play as a samurai, that's cool. Yeah. That is, that is objectively a cool thing. Like, it is... And, and like, this is how I even know it. Uh, no one cares. They go, but my realism. You could beat up the Pope. Exactly, that's a thing. In the like UFO. Historical accuracy. Yeah, you fist fight the Pope. In a UFO. And you know what? You know what else? That's cool too. <laughs> yeah. Remember when Assassin's Creed was cool, where you could punch a Pope in a UFO under the Vatican as the finale, and then it proceeds to go to end with a literal fourth wall break. Yeah, 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 of an alien trying to contact a random Italian man during the Renaissance. <laughs> what, what do you mean, the realism? Shut up, you dumb, dumb idiot. They had a whole DLC of what if George Washington was on the side of the Brits <laughs> and beat the British so that way he could rule the 13 colonies. What are you, would you like your crack pipe now <laughs> or later? Just say you're racist and be done with it, I'd God. Res I'd respect you more if you just actually just said that than do all these, like, hoops and hurls. And there was, like, so, like, two dudes on Twitter who goes, <coughs> I'm actually a Japanese historian that was found out, like, two days later they were just white dudes. <laughs> okay, of course. So that's who's on your side. Two historians who said it's not true. It was a white dude the whole time versus literal history. Mm -hmm. Who cares? Who cares? Yasuke's cool. Just admit, yeah. Yasuke's cool. Afro Samurai's cool. No one had a problem with exactly. Afro Samurai. That's the most... Maybe if they got Samuel L. Jackson to voice Yasuke in this, people would dude. be mad. <laughs> maybe, maybe that's all they need to... Do we know who's voicing Yasuke in this? There is no way after that they're revealing his name <laughs> anytime Probably. soon. What if they do get Samuel L. Jackson to voice him, and they're like, you're going you're to be mad at Sam Jackson? Yeah, right? yeah, yeah. Are you really, really going to be pissed about that? Oh, my God. Imagine if they do get him or, like, a Keith David, like, someone who's just that beloved to voice him. There's no way that it, it imagine. I, I would actually want that just to see what would happen. That would be the one time I'm okay with the Hollywood voice actor. Right. Yeah. Imagine, like, imagine they get him, and who's like a, 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 an actress that literally no one hates? Mm. Um, oh, oh, oh. It has to be, um, it has to be an Asian woman. Um, oh, oh, she's in everything now. Everything, everywhere, all at once. Michelle. Oh, Michelle Yeoh. Yeah, Michelle Yeoh. Mm. Samuel Jack, like, I know it's like a Reddit tier thing, yeah. but like you're really gonna get mad at those two. I actually and like, God, that would be so funny. That'd be so. And the funny. best part is, I could, 
Keith David's not a bad pick, honestly. To play Yasuke? Oh, no. Like, that's not a bad pick. No, it's not. I was memeing with Sam Jackson, but Keith David, like. Uh, yeah, yeah. Like, all right, yeah, all right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, we were just doing that because of Afro Samurai. Yeah. You know, God bless Afro Samurai. But, like, geez. Geez. It's like, I, ab- you, you have, like, uh, uh, potatoes in mm-hmm. your brain. And I keep seeing people, it's like, uh, 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 my realism. More realism. Bro, there's literally a plot point in Assassin's Creed Revelations. Again, it's a plot about uh, assassins and Templars doing a war with each other. There's, there's literally a whole plot line saying the Templars took over the American Congress and the uh, Republican mm-hmm. Party. <laughs> More realism? <laughs> like what? <laughs> Are you st- are you dumb? Yeah. Are, do, do you have sh- show me on the piece of paper when Assassin's Creed was realistic, where you could jump off a ten foot story building, shank someone in the neck, and do a little roll, and then like do the Fortnite floss and be totally fine without breaking. <laughs> in, in Assassin's Creed Brotherhood, you got a hook arm where you can jump off of any building, stick out the hook, grab onto it, and you're fine. And you don't lose damage. His arm should be torn mm-hmm. off. No, it's fine. It's fine, man. It's fine.